Hey guys, Eric here. Um, it's been a while since I've seen you all, um, but I'm sure you're a bit surprised that I am uploading a video back home. Um, That's because a couple days ago I returned from Fort Sill, Oklahoma, um, and things didn't exactly work out for me uh, in the Army. Uh, so I have returned home, uh, and I am going to remain as a civilian uh, for the foreseeable future. Um, the Army is, well, not for everyone, and I realized that very quickly, and I felt that I did not belong there. Um, my body just could not handle uh, what was, you know, the tasks that were at hand. Um, I was afraid um, that, um, pretty much, that I was going to fall apart, and that started to happen. Um, I'm actually trying to get my hand fixed up a little bit. Uh, my knuckles are actually cracked. Uh, the skin is cracked severely uh, due to the intense weather in Oklahoma that they have, especially when I first got there. It was extremely cold, everything was covered in ice, and the wind was brutal um, to the point where I thought I was going to get hypothermia or frostbite or both. Um, and also I'm having issues with my back and with my left leg, which I'm going to get checked out, um, uh, hopefully within the next couple weeks before I return to work. Um, so again, things didn't exactly work out. I was going, I was there for a little over three weeks. Uh, I returned home, uh, two days ago, if I remember correctly. I'm still trying to get used to being back home. Um, as you can tell, um, I really don't have much in here right now everything is still uh, behind this dresser here inside this false wall which basically has a little shed uh, a lot of my stuff is still back there a lot of stuff is in the closet behind me um, I brought home some extra clothes so, so I have some clothes that are on top of the uh, the dresser there because I just can't fit everything right now <sighs> so uh, let me see where the heck is that thing ah. So, I mean, I did manage to bring a few things home uh, from the army uh, that I bought, or, well, they did, I simply can't return for sanitary reasons. Um, one of which is the traditional army flashlight. That's the L shape, runs on D batteries. There you are. It's fully operational right now, mostly because, well, we're in the middle of a blizzard. <sighs> it's gotta be great. Been home for two days, and now we're in the middle of a blizzard. It's supposed to get up to 30 inches of snow, and everything is shut down. Uh, right now, well, everything will be shut down in about uh, 100 minutes from now. It's 10.20 p.m. or 22.30 if you are uh, doing military time, like I used to do. Uh, also, I got the traditional earplugs. Uh, of course, I got to keep these. Uh, these are very nice, actually. Uh, as well as hand sanitizer. This is the Army hand sanitizer, Purell, uh, the bio-based version. Um, but, yeah, everything thing, uh, you know, is going to start to return to normal for me. Um, once I get myself recovered, I'm still very tired. Um, it's been a long couple days since I've been back. Um, so I've been resting up. Uh, of course, I have to get a lot of stuff taken care of. I just got my job back at Target. Uh, of course, that was guaranteed regardless because I was on military leave. Um... Right now, in terms of bowling, uh, that is going to be put on hold for the next several months uh, due to um, restrictions put in place by my folks. Uh, for the next several months, I'm going to be saving up to buy my own vehicle. Um, so that's going to take mo probably most of the year. Um, as uh, some of you might know, there's a new bowling alley opening up within a few minutes of my house, and I'm going to try and get a job there as well uh, so I can get some extra money. Uh, coming in so I can purchase a new car or a decent used car hopefully by the end of the year um, and also return to college I'm not sure what I'm going to do there because the college account is wiped out um, so in terms of college it's probably going to be a few years before I go back to that so for right now it's just going to be Target and uh, the Bowling Center once I get a job there um, you know that'll be supplementing my income for probably the next several years until I can get back to college and knowing I can afford it because, well, with the way college is so expensive now, I refuse to take out college loans simply because I hate debt. I don't like owing anyone anything. 
So, uh, for now, uh, college is off the table. Um, you know, in terms of finishing getting my business degree. Um, so again, the army simply is not for everyone. Um, and I realized it wasn't for me very quickly. Um, you know, my family has been in the military. I figured I'd give it a shot. Uh, I wanted to try to better myself. I wanted to become a better person. And I realized very quickly that that wasn't the way for me to go. Uh, I felt that I was needed more here. Um, and every part of me, physically, mentally, spiritually, um, emotionally, was broken. Broken to the point where I felt that I wasn't a human being anymore. Uh, it got to the point where I simply, at some point, I just wanted to die. It was just so bad. The drill sergeants treat you like crap, especially in reception. Um, so if you ever plan to join the army, uh, be prepared to go through hell for the first two to four weeks uh, because they will drop you a lot. Uh, of course, it depends on the drill sergeants, it depends on where you go. Again, I went to Fort Sill in Oklahoma. Uh, it's kind of iffy over there. It's a big place, very, very, very big. Uh, it's size, I'd say, of at least a decent sized city. Um, but it's not the greatest place to be. Um, and that's just me being completely honest. As you can tell, uh, a day or two ago, I uh, launched uh, several new videos. I have a lot of videos uploaded. Uh, I have a bunch that are still scheduled. I'm going to leave them scheduled for now. Uh, because again, I don't know how many more times I'm going to be up able to upload bowling videos. At this point, um, once I'm able to get some more videos up, it's uh, probably sometime in April because uh, I want to finish let these videos that I have uploaded. I want to get them. Want to make sure they get online, um, you know, so that they can be. Um, they'll be going up twice a week. Uh, probably, I'm not sure when the next one's going to be up. To be honest with you, right now, because uh, again, I'm trying to get everything uh, settled back into their places again. I got to get stuff back into the room. Um, it's, I'm going to be very busy uh, for the next couple weeks until I go back to work. Um, you know, in terms of going to doctor's appointments, get my back fixed, to get my, uh, get my leg checked out, um, you know, and just getting back into the swing of things. Uh, again, bowling, in terms of bowling, I'm not going to be bowling for the next several months, unfortunately. Um, you know, it's, you know, it was a hard thing for me to have to do, but, you know, it was part of an agreement. Um, so, let's see, what else is there? So again, I am back home, for sure, and that's the way it's going to be. Uh, you know, I am satisfied with the time I spent in the Army, even though it was very short. Um, but, you know, I did learn quite a few things over there, and, uh, you know, I'm, I felt that it wasn't a waste of time. Uh, you know, it was uh, something I'll never forget. And, you know, I, again, I just feel that I am better off being here at home. And right now I'm happy with that decision. Um, you know, unfortunately, because of this decision, I have lost a couple friends of mine uh, who did not accept this decision um, in my personal life. Um, you know, removed them from Facebook, removed them from my life. You know, it's... Uh, that's how it is. You know, if you don't, uh, if you don't respect people's uh, opinions or decisions, you well, know, you, uh, you don't deserve to be friends with them. You don't deserve to know them. Uh, that's just how it is. Anyway, I'm starting to ramble a little bit. So, again, I'm back home. Bowling's on hold. Videos are still going to go up, but it's mostly at this point, it's probably going to be like edited clips, uh, maybe a couple compilations here and there. Again, uh, new stuff isn't going to be uploaded until probably sometime in April, maybe. Um, maybe late. Uh, yeah, I think I have a video scheduled to go up until the end of March. Um, but again, I'd have to double check um, that stuff. Because, um, as you can tell, again, I'm going to be very busy just getting everything back in order. And, uh, yeah, and get this room filled up again, because 
everything is still in a bunch of boxes. And unfortunately, it's going to be cold for the next week, so I'm not going to be able to really get in there and get everything out again. <sighs> so yeah, now it's time for me to get some sleep. I'm exhausted. And Wednesday, I'm going to be even more exhausted after shoveling two and a half feet of snow. Yeah! <sighs> so that's it. Uh, that's all I've got. So I'll see you all on the flip side. Again, hopefully uh, sooner rather than later. I'll be bowling again. Uh, of course, I'm going to try and bowl when Wamasset Lanes opens up. I'm going to try and you know get a, get a few games in there because it's going to be Candlepin and Tenpin. Hopefully I'll be working there. Which will be uh, which will be very nice. I think uh, you know. Ne I've always wanted to try to work at a bowling center, and you know this is my chance. So, anyways, I'll see you all later. Have a good one.